Today's What's in Your Vault is like a box of chocolates. I often say that when I come into the building, you never know what you're going to see and you never know what's going to be coming your way. Well, the treasure of the SS Central America has been that way for over three decades. It came to light that there was a passenger on ship that boarded the ship in Aspinwall and then obviously went down with the ship on September 12th. In 2014, near the Garden of Gold, they find a pile of Chilean coins. I've got a treasure box full of coins from Chile that belonged to Pascual Esquerra. Further research showed that there was a Chilean businessman that got on the ship, unfortunately for him, in Aspinwall and was aboard the SS Central America. The thought was that he was on his way back to Spain and he was taking his wealth with him. Well, he didn't make it, but his coins have made it. Today, I'm gonna to show you a treasure box, keeping in mind that these were on the bottom of the ocean for 150 years. So this is quite heavy, so I'm gonna put it down here to take a look at it. And what you're looking at right here is literally a box full of Chilean pesos and 50 centavos. But look at this, literally treasure, history in your hands. This is literally a box full of these coins. I mean, they're just incredible. And today, we're telling the story of a man that they belong to, 150 some odd years later. The details of the coins, I mean, some of them are just really super nice. And what's gonna happen with every one of these coins that you see, they're gonna wind up in holders like this. So the provenance is now lasting forever unless you break it out of the case. Log on to finestknown.com, look at the treasure coins that we have listed there, pick up some of these before they're gone because they're priced at a price that you, you're not gonna believe. Again, finestknown.com, search for treasure coins. Mm -hmm.